We're gonna double, double the trouble. And five times the fun. And today we are on a Disney cruise for the <laughs> very first time. Come along with us as we explore the Disney wonder. Uh, we are going to Ensenada. We are going to Cabo San Lucas. And we are and going it's, to... It's oh, and... Halloween. You're not, you're not Grammy Graham, but it's <laughs> Halloween on the high seas. Yes, and this is what happens when mommy gets shirts for everyone else and forgets about a shirt for herself. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> but it is Halloween, Halloween on, on the high seas. seas. And guess what? It is also Trisha's birthday. Come along with so, us. So today though, today we're gonna do embarkation process. We're gonna do all kinds of fun stuff. All kinds of fun yes. things. Yes. Lots of exploring. Yes. We're gonna leave it at that. Yeah. <laughs> You'll have to watch to find out. I, I just wanna show you how shaky this boat is. Look at this. Oh, it's shaky. Shaky. <laughs> shaky. 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 Alright. <laughs> Alright, come along with us, check it out. We're excited. We hope you're excited too. Let's go. Let's go. We are on. We are here in San Diego. We've arrived. Uh, we are walking over to the port where the Disney Wonder is parked. Um, one thing we didn't really think all the way through, or I really didn't think all the way through. I, I didn't think at all. <laughs> is the fact that, okay, so you have to park, and I did that. I booked the parking reservations and everything. However. Well, parking's not included. No, so you have included. to find your own parking. Yes. It's not like to, Disney parking. Right, so you have to go onto the port website and find the different locations that they have for you to park. So um, I registered our parking, paid ahead of time so you can save money, but they don't have shuttle service. So we ended up having- Well, where we parked. Yeah, where well, we parked. We, we parked at the Hyatt- Grand. Hyatt Grand Regency, San Diego. Yes. About six blocks away. Yes, and they don't have um, a shuttle there. So and we, we have to, um, nine people. Yeah, and a lot of baggage. A lot of baggage. So we ended up having to come to the port, which was totally fine. It was really easy. We pulled in, we unloaded, they put the baggage tags on our luggage for us. And then we dropped off our luggage, we dropped off the rest of our party, yep. and then we went back to the Hyatt Regency uh, brand, whatever it's called, and we <laughs> parked. And now we are walking our six blocks over to the port. So, so, book your parking ahead of time. Yes, to save money. Be prepared to drive straight to the ship and drop off anybody who, we had somebody who's handicapped with us, my mom, out of all the kids, the babies. So make sure to drop off everybody in all bags at the Disney Wonder. Yes. And then uh, leave all your stuff there too so you don't have to carry it back. Right. Yeah, and then uh, it was pretty easy though, yeah. So uh, we're gonna go meet up with everybody now and start the embarkation check-in process. Yes. All right. <laughs> Super excited. Be back. We made it. One. Why are you waiting? Yeah. Yeah? Were you waiting? I want it! I want to go on the cruise now! Okay, somebody's excited. Are you excited? Yeah. You ready to get started? I want to go. Let's do this. Oh, get it started. Oh, get it started. Let's get it started. All right, yeah. let's go, guys. You are the only All right, so they keep asking us for this port arrival form, which apparently is a QR code you get when you do online check-in, which I don't think we saved. So when you do online check-in, take a picture of your port arrival form, because we can't find it in the app anywhere. They're telling us in the app. Let's see if we can find it before it's time to check in. Hulk? Your back's hurting? Yeah. You got the littlest backpack. Don't you carry a backpack at school? Yeah, but this one has cameras and Maverick school stuff and then more cameras and then my racist stuff. Oh, all the awesome stuff you get. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. You have to yeah. put it on, okay? Okay, we'll put it on you. Magic band. I'm 
many times does it take to check in on I this? Like how many how many times have we checked in? Fifty. Fifty? I say fifty-two. Lincoln, how many times have we checked in? Five billion. A million? Five billion. Five billion. That sounds about right. To be super sure that we belong here. <laughs> yeah. And make sure you have your QR code. How the the six year old over here managed to have yeah. a QR code. My, my mom's the only one who brought a QR code. Oh, both of them actually. And the forty year old. Yeah. The, the old people <laughs> brought the right stuff. Yeah. <laughs> uh. We are on. Hey, when, they, when, when, we, when we walk in, are they going to say, ladies and gentlemen, the snapback brother family? You don't think so? Tech, are you going to go on that big boat? Look how big that boat is, yo! It's so big! Does he want the please for the both of us, family? Oh, you underestimated us. We got an announcement. We still have to check in. <laughs> Again. Yeah. Again. We want to make sure we have so all of you guys I here with my us. I'm outside of my state room. <laughs> this feels so what, weird to, to be in a, like a mini earthquake. Uh, yeah? You're going to fall like, down? It's like skateboarding, bro. Uh, it's like wavy. Do you guys know what, what sign we stand? Yeah, I feel like I'm good. Oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, mine says mandatory Thank you. Oh, we got a sailor. No, no. Put it down. Let's go check into our room. I need to save the shrimp. I need to do it. I need to save the shrimp. Look at it. There's billions of shrimps just coming. That, that's called dinner. Right. Here's all our stuff. Just pretending we're close. Oh, look! Look, we got DVC member, Disney Vacation Club member. Let's go! How do we get it now? <laughs> you need your QR code. Shut up. Wait, wait. How do we? No, seriously. But how do we get in? Uh, they said the door would be open. Try to open it. Our right, keys on the floor. We would just leave keys on the floor. How did she get in? Robin. They said the key was out. We're never gonna get. All right. Finally, found our keys. Okay, okay, okay. Come on in. Welcome home, guys. Yeah. We're moving. Yeah, that jet ski is about to get hit. Get out of here, jet ski. Jet ski's trying to race us. <laughs> we are slow. We're a big boat. You want to fight us? We'll smash you. Let's see how who can run each hey, other Hey, give me over. a bye, San Diego. Bye, San Diego. That guy want to go. That's, that's another signal. Level. You want to go head to head? We can, we can go bam. Hey, let the jet ski go. We're moving. This is the best. Oh my goodness. Oh. Yeah. oh that was the most exhausting check-in yeah. process ever. Definitely. Yeah, so it was all a blur, but basically you go through 7,000 check-in gates. Yeah. And yeah. everyone asked you for a QR code, which we did not have this QR code. Yeah. So every time they asked, we had to pull up our room number and pull up all our names, and there's one million of us. So if you're a big family like us, put some time in for check-in. Apparently yeah. they've been checking people in since 8 a.m. and they checked us in at uh, 2 p.m. 
and they said basically we were the last 200 people so i guess you board based on how many cruises you've ridden you know if you, you got seniority status you get to get on early so we, we were one of the last yeah. people to get on yeah we were rushed through but oh baby whoa, 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 we got a baby whoa, whoa, over here whoa, whoa, whoa. mom's changing the other baby okay, over there that's the way all right so but we have we don't have time to see our room because there is a sail away party that yeah. happens uh, at 4 30 it is 4 13 so we are going to change the babies rush to the sail away party yeah and uh or get our ten. get our crew started we will do a room review later but all in all the check-in process was tedious the technology didn't work great if it did yeah. work great it would have been great but it didn't but yeah you so, excited yeah yeah i'm really excited and what are you gonna say um, uh, basically, I just want to go to the um, sail away party. All right, let's do it. That was a an ordeal. That look, <laughs> let me tell you, cruising is a lot of fun. Yes. But if you're traveling with a big party, it is a lot. I mean, that was a lot of energy. So we we got we made it to the sail away party in time. It's a sail away. Yes. Oh, I thought it was wave. It's a double entendre. Yes. A sail away. Is the dress blue or gold? Did you, you see the light bulb? Yeah. Yes. Off? Yes. No, you <laughs> saw. Uh, I, mine was a wave. Yes. Sail away. Yes, but then yes, and then your yes. light bulb too. Yes, it's okay. a double entendre. It's pretty cool. Yes. yes. <laughs> okay. Anyways, um, so basically, um, the cruise director oh, they brought up Mickey. It was a, I think it was a very happy way to send us off yes and um get people's energy up and all that good stuff but also the crew they snuck in some information on us so the cruise director could come out and tell us some you know safety information as well as um uh what to do tonight what to expect yada yada so that was cool that was yes. a lot of fun um we thought we would watch the city sail away from the back of the boat but turns out our balcony is just as good of a place as any so we came back to get changed up before dinner um when you get on the boat after checking in 12 trillion times <laughs> You have to do your muster drill, and they're doing it all digital now. Yeah, that was really, it was really cool. Um, very simple. You go meet in one room, they tell you how to log in, and then you go to your location, scan it, and then you're done. And it was really simple. Yeah. It was easy. So, uh, we are going to, uh, we, we've been having a little relaxing time, sailing off. The kids have thought it's so awesome. So, this is our first Disney cruise. Yes. We've been on two cruises. Yes. Uh, Norwegian and Royal Caribbean? Uh... Or Car Carnival. Carnival. Okay, yeah, yeah Norwegian, Norwegian and Carnival. And then, um, but this is our first Disney cruise. Lincoln's been on a cruise. We got married on a cruise, actually, but he was only one. So this is his uh, second cruise, and everybody else is first. So they're super excited just about the boat and the waves and <laughs> everything uh, that, that, that they've experienced so far. So uh, dinner is very soon, but we want to give you guys a room tour before we destroy this room. Yes, because it will be destroyed. <laughs> yes, we have three staterooms between our group, uh, but... Um, our room, I'm sure, with everybody going in and out, will be a mess very soon. So it's, yes. it's very small, but it's a cruise boat. So. Yes. I mean, it's big for a... We'll show you. Yes. We'll check it out. <laughs> check it out. Welcome to our crib. <laughs> 
Welcome to our stateroom. We, um, it's a really nice, spacious little area here. I like how everything is laid out. It's, it's a really cool. entryway. It's an, this is our entryway. Yes. Um, and we have, we start off with the closet. It has double sizes. Actually, um, a nice size. Nice wood I, too. Yeah, I already have stuff piled in here. We have strollers uh, and, and all kinds oh, of stuff. Yeah. Costumes, double, double strollers. Double strollers, costumes all jammed in, but it gives you um, a nice amount of space. Um, I like the amount of hangers that it gives you, right? There's plenty of hangers. So yeah, be, we could not unpack if we wanted to. I uh, would probably, probably be pretty I mean, difficult. There's so many of us. Uh, yeah. um, and then it has the other side, right? Um, continue on more hangers there. Lots of hangers, for real. Lots and lots. And more stroller. Yes, more stroller. Um, we have two parts to the bathroom, which is awesome. Um, uh, that is actually pretty genius. Yes, yeah. it really is. Um, we have the first part, which is the toilet. Um, so we have um, so the water have closet. The water closet. Yes, we have the water closet with a sink in this one, uh, which is really neat. Love the light. What's uh? What is this you have over here? Let's see. Let uh, me see. This is a. Let, let's switch. Oh whoa. Whoa. One second. Slow mo. <laughs> We have a visitor. Blowing my, my uh, outfit off. Anywho, we have a hair dryer. Um, like, Hold on. <laughs> we have a visitor. That room. I that room. Filming. <laughs> okay. So we have uh, we have our first part of our bathroom. Oh, and and, and you yes. wait. Got some little shelving here to to put that. to put unpack and there's a plug. So when you need to curl your hair, ladies, all that good stuff. Yes. I got you. And then right. the second part of our bathroom is right next door. Um, and this is my favorite part. Oh no, my favorite part is that part. Yes, it is. The other. Thirty minutes or so of every morning. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Anywho. Yeah. Or afternoon. <laughs> Didn't mean to put your business out there. Uh -huh. um, but we have the second part of the bathroom, which is a shower and a tub. Um, and, and for the tub. kids, we got babies. For the babies, right? So. Um, I mean, I don't know if Trey's gonna fit in here. I could fit. Um, My head is gonna be pretty close to that ceiling. Probably pretty close to the yeah. wall. Um, but it's it's a nice size. A second I mean, sink. Yeah, second seat. And H two O backside of water, baby. <laughs> Just love, like at the hotels. Absolutely love that those products. Anytime we go uh, to the Disney World resorts, we steal them. Um, tons. That's why they. That's why they put them in those things. I know, right. Yeah. Tons of um, storage space. I'm not going to go into them because, uh, quite frankly, it's been very chaotic. So I've just been throwing stuff into them. There's already stuff in the drawers. Yeah. Oh my god! In a way, yes. Oh my gosh. In the drawers. Um, this is really cool for. Oh the yeah. Who are cruising with infants? We have a. They left this, or they brought brought this uh, diaper genie and had it here for us in the in the stateroom. Um, and then we also have a crib, right? And then they gave us a pack and play and, and a diaper genie. And, bedding and all that so that's really neat. that's really sick i'm super hyped about the diaper genie we don't use them at home but we'll use them here we do until the kids broke it yeah. so <laughs> yeah uh, we have a very nice size bed here um all the decorations as you can probably hear the kiddos are fussing in the next room mm -hmm. that's, that's a nice room. size for us i can rock with that yeah it's a nice size we have more um storage space there's a lot of storage space actually lots lots of storage space we have our television over here uh which techie's favorite part tech, yes he's been trying to watch tv already um and it swivels so you can watch it while you're over in bed or you can watch it while you're chilling out on the couch and what kind of room is this this is a oh goodness i don't know it's a deluxe, deluxe state room. ocean view state ocean room view state veranda room. yes there's yes. something that word with the veranda right too down here it says yeah. it right down, yeah. down there oh yeah <laughs> thanks <laughs> Um, and then we have our nice cozy couch couch bed here. This pulls out and can be a bed as well. And then from my understanding, I don't, is this, do we, we is that? It's not, a, oh, I think that you can pull another bed down yes, from up I there for can. more kids, I but. Think you can. We're uh we're taking the babies though. Yes, we're taking the babies in here. Uh, the older three will be next door in Grammy's room with her. Um, so I don't know. Maybe we they'll pull, pull it down. down. And yeah, we'll, yeah. We'll show you if they happen to pull it down over there. And. Um, and then of course we have the piste resistance. Right. Oh wait, I gotta stop down the balcony. <laughs> and we have our stuff on the balcony. Oh yeah, there's. <laughs> Don't look down there. We moved just it, look up there. We moved it out of the way so we just can for, do our Just for tour. the tour. Yes. We will not leave it here. Um, and so we have our nice balcony. Look at all the boats. Hi. Hello. No. no they don't see you. They don't see you. It's too much to see. All right. Too much to see. So we have our beautiful balcony. And? And? And I think, and our balconies also happen to connect. Let's see if there happens to be 
Nobody's out there. Oh, there's Lincoln. There's Lincoln. Hi. But that's my mom's balcony with the kids there, so. Yes. So we're super excited. We're settling in, but uh, most importantly, it's dinner time. We're going to yes. go check out uh, the, the restaurant for tonight. I think we're at Titan's tonight. It is King Triton, and he would be offended. It's your favorite Disney movie, and you called him Titan like, like a Greek w w god. I'm sorry. Greek. Battle of the Greek Gods. I'm sorry, King Triton. Yes. We're having dinner at Triton tonight. Um, so I'm super excited to see what that's all about. I'm super excited to see the options. Trey already knows because he looked it up on the app. I can't. Um, so, whoa, guys. Whoa. Coming in close there. Whoa. You could just, you could just, whoa. <laughs> He's got bumpers. He's just going to. Yeah. Uh, Maverick. Right. Wait. Yeah. Yo, look at this guy. What is he doing? Whoa, whoa, he's like he's steering us. He's trying to, he's trying to race us. He's gonna bump us. Wait, I want to see this. What's happening? He's bumping us. It says pilot on his. Oh, he's the pilot for our boat. I don't. What's happening? I don't know. We're witnessing a unique experience. Maybe do, do, do these boats have pilots? Do they have people who lead them out? I don't know. Maybe he's guiding us out. All right. Well, we got a pilot down there. We don't know what he's doing, but it's pretty cool. All right, well, we're, we're late for dinner. Yes. Time to eat. Yes. All right. Bye. Bye. You're tired? You're you're seven, bro. Eight? You're eight. I, I, I'm more not tired. You can't be tired. But also... What are you ordering? There is... There is a few... There is a few things I can order. A few things that caught your eye? Yes. Well, it's a good thing you can order them all, huh? If you, uh, only if you can eat them all. I, would, I really want to get the raspberry cheesecake with raspberry sauce. You're gonna, you're gonna start with dessert. Yeah. You wish. And then I'm, I'm also gonna eat that after. All right, yeah. Lincoln. What about you? You found something you like on there, Mr. Picky? You, you're not gonna. Eat, you're on a cruise and you're gonna eat nothing. So we made it to Triton's. It is located on the fourth. What was the fourth floor? Third. No, oh, third floor. Yes, third floor. Third, third floor. Uh, it is Little Mermaid themed, right? Very loosely. There's a wonderful mosaic on the wall with King Triton and Ariel and Flounder, which is really cool. Um, we are here. Um, our table is right next to the exit um, or entrance, which was uh, convenient. Um, and we are looking at the menu. They have, of course, nowadays everywhere has a QR code where you can scan to get the menu and then look at it over your phone. Um, so we have reviewed the options. We have appetizers. We have entrees to choose from. We have um, we have desserts. Uh, the kids have a separate kids menu that they can choose from as well. Um, or we let them know, you know, if they would like to choose something from the adult menu, they can do that as well. Um, so that is an option. We are having some delicious bread. Yeah. Uh, bread. And it came with some dip. Yeah, it came with this interesting dipping sauce. We're, we're, we haven't quite put our finger on it. Um, that dip is good. It, but it is really good, which is different, right? Not not butter, but they gave us a dip, which is really cool. Um, so, yeah, we are going to order, and we're going to enjoy our first dinner together. And we'll see what happens after that. <laughs> we'll check in later. All right, so I'm going to give you a little entree review. We got the penne arabatia. Uh, it's got some shrimp in here, some tomato sauce. He said it was a little spicy. I love spicy. So let's see. By you know, spicy by their standards is probably not high by mine. I'm gonna pull the tail off my shrimp. Still got the tails on there, and uh, get a little shrimp in my bite. Mm. It's okay. Thank you. You got about very hot. Yeah. Thank you. Hot plate. No. Oh. All right. Just in time. I also ordered the the Wellington, and it just came. Got a birthday celebration. All right, the pasta is pretty good. I wouldn't call it spicy, but it definitely has a nice flavor to it. The shrimp was well cooked. Um, 
Overall, it's good, maybe not great. Hopefully, this beef Wellington will knock my soft sauce. Oh, it's, it's pork tenderloin Wellington. And I am very excited to try this. You might need to get a shot of this, Treese, because I haven't got a shot of it. They just brought it right in. Treese is going to give you a little. It looks, the presentation's nice, yeah. All right. I don't know that I've had pork tenderloin Wellington before. Have you? Wellington, um, Gordon Ramsay. Gordon Ramsay, Gordon Ramsay Master yeah. Chef. Okay, there's a lot of it's a lot of uh, mushrooms here. I'm gonna pretend that I don't see them and just close my eyes and take a bite here. We're good. That's good. I'm a fan. Even though I don't like mushrooms, I'm a fan. The mushrooms aren't too strong. It's got beautiful flavor, flaky, well cooked, delicious. Definitely, um, this, I mean the calamari is the best thing I had so far, but this is coming in a close second. So if I had to recommend one, I definitely go with the Wellington, but they're both good. All right, so uh, I got Maverick here to try out this trio of desserts we have here. We have mango marble cheesecake. Um, with some whipped cream and fruit. We have some fig and pecan pudding with, it looks like some, you know, some red stuff and, 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 and uh, vanilla ice cream. And we have uh, daddy's favorite, creme brulee. It's Kahlua creme, bru creme, creme brulee. So um, with shortbread cookies. So Maverick, try out the, um, the mango cheesecake. Let's see what you think. I don't know how to get it. Woo! mango -y, huh? Got some faces there. It's tart. Yeah. No, it's not tart. It's just the flavor. It's it tastes more like yeah. cheesecake it's, than mango. I I cannot taste any type of mango. Nope. Yeah. It's not very sweet. It's um yeah, it's kind of a savory type of cheesecake. It is pretty good though. I like it. Would you want to try the creme brulee? You want to try this? No. Nope. Yes. I'm going to try this. This looks delicious. Oh, come on, Dad. Oh, wow. That's interesting. <laughs> There's nuts inside of these things. It's like fried pe pecans and stuff and ice cream. Give it a shot. Oh, and there's like fig, fig pudding. That's good. You want to try it? All right. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good, actually. Pretty good, actually. You like this one better than that one? Yeah. Me too, man. And then, ooh, creme brulee, nice and flaky on the crust. I am not tasting that. Mmm. Oh, okay. This one's a little tart. It's got, like, um, some coffee flavoring to it. I think it's got, like, Kahlua flavor, but you can't taste it. It's, but it's it's light, and it's delicious. I think the thick pudding is actually my favorite, but creme brulee is a close second, so... uh. I'd recommend if you I could only pick one, try this pudding because it's different, it's unique, and uh, I don't really find anything like it anywhere else. So let us know what you think. We're going to take the babies, put them to sleep, and we're going to see what entertainment options this ship has to offer. Oh, that's cool. Oh, look at the TV. And look at the bunk beds. Yeah. Goodbye, good night. Bunk beds and TV. This is, you guys got a cool little room in here. I am a woo. <laughs> I am a woo. What's a woo? <laughs> you keep busting your head. These are pretty cool, guys. Excuse us. You're moving in? Move it. Come here, baby. They have cool bunk beds, and we have this uh, penguin that's cold, as Lincoln pointed out. It's a penguin that is cold. How cute is that? So, All right, we're dumping the babies off of Grammy and off to the show. So the food was um, really good. We're going to see the Golden Mickey, the Golden Mickey at the um, Walt Disney Theater. It's on um, um, level four, if you want to know. And uh, we're gonna go check it out right Our now. Our first show on a cruise ship. Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. See what it's about. Yes. All right, let's go.
fantastic. And welcome down to the Walt Disney Theatre, as well as a first in person, welcome aboard. Are you excited for the cruise? Well, we are excited to have you here. And I should take this moment to take a step back and reintroduce myself. My name is Lee, I am your cruise director. I come all the way from England. Anyone else from England? That was awkward. <laughs> Anyone not from England? Yeah. We're outnumbered, yay. Well, uh, I do like to know who we have sailing with us. So one by one, what's your name, where you're from, how many cruises you've been on? No, Ooh, okay. We'll do it the easier way. Uh, make some noise if you're a Disney Vacation Club member. Woo! Seven of you. <laughs> this is going great. Uh, welcome home. What about our repeat cruisers? Any Castaway Club members in the audience? Welcome back, welcome back. And then that leaves one group. Who's celebrating their first Disney cruise? <laughs> welcome aboard. Who didn't cheer for any of them? <laughs> well, whether it's your first cruise or your 50th, we're very excited to have you here. We're visiting some stunning ports of call, including Cabo San Lucas and Ensenada. Who's excited for our ports of call? If you have a top tip, if you've not yet booked yourself on a port adventure, check out the Disney Cruise Line app or visit the Port Adventures desk, Deck 3 Midship, because the best way to see our ports of call is indeed through the eyes of a port adventure. And also, we're very excited. We've got lots of fun events, activities and offerings in store for you, including our Halloween on the High Seas enhancements. But you can find out what's going on and where to be by using your Disney Cruise Line Navigator app. Or, if you want to have a laugh, why don't you watch the morning show each and every morning, channel number one, myself and your assistant cruise director David will be giving you our highlights of what to go and do and what to see. Last cruise we had a total of 42 viewers. I know right, it was just us watching it again and again and again. So hopefully this cruise we actually get more and when you see us out and about and around the ship, please let us know that you're watching the morning show so that we can keep count. Uh, but as we are right here in the Walt Disney Theatre, it's only fair to introduce our first Broadway caliber performance. So as a quite uh, quick reminder, please no video recording or photography during the show. We do want you to enjoy this as it's intended, which is live. But when you see your favourite Disney friends here on stage, shout, scream, go crazy, go wild, because they can't wait to be out performing for you. Disney want to sit back, relax and go crazy as we proudly present The Golden Mickeys! Enjoy! Yeah. <laughs> That show was so good. What it did you guys so think good. of? What did you guys think of the Golden Mickeys? Oh, uh, good. Okay. Good. good. <laughs> I asked what was so that, good about it? Uh, probably how. Um, I don't. So what was it about? What happened? Somebody give me a quick, short summary. Who wants to give it to me? It was about getting on board. Okay. That's not English. <laughs> what happened? Uh, basically, um, Goofy hurt Mickey. Then this um girl took over the show, who was supposed to be in charge of the um behind stage. But then, um, blah, blah, blah. They played a lot of musicals stuff. from all the yeah. Disney movies. Yes. They played so many songs from so many movies. Yes, and the moral of the story was you should you should believe in yourself. Don't give up. Keep trying, right? And right. and things will, will happen. You'll be successful. And, 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 and think big. Have think big, big dreams. Try yes. to change the world. Yes, but we are very impressed by the, the quality of the production, um, the, ca the cast. They were amazing. They did an excellent job. They could sing. They could dance. They could do acrobatics. Um, it just it, there was everything. Techie, please don't do that. You might break it. Thank you. you. It had everything. It had a little bit of everything, and it just exceeded my expectations. So I'm and, super excited. And um, uh, they did not allow video recording. Yes, they so, did not. So we so we respected their wishes yes. and did not record. Yes. However, I will say that there was a musical with lots of musical numbers, and. Um, they costumes were awesome. Yes, the songs were awesome, and everybody was so talented. Yes, yes, they definitely were. It was definitely worth uh, going to see. Do not miss it. And I think it was the perfect show to kick off our trip. So that was really cool. So what are we doing now? We are going to get some ice cream. No, we to get some. No, nope. we oh, yes. are. We are going to get some ice cream. Oh, but. We have to go back to the room and we have to do a little decorating. After so, ice cream. Yes, after ice cream. So we're going to grab some ice cream, go back to the room, and we're going to do some decorating and we'll show you what we mean by doing some decorating. <laughs> As we 
shared with you, this is our very first Disney cruise. And one of the things that we learned about in our research preparing for this cruise is what they call the fish extender program. Which I um, finally get because there's a fish. I was like, why the heck? Yes, what is a fish extender? <laughs> yes. Yeah. So, yes. Yeah, so it's a program where you exchange gifts with different family members who are aboard the ship. So you have to go out and seek the groups. They have them. This one I found on Facebook. Um, and this is something that has been ongoing. I don't know how many years. And I think is it different, only Disney Cruise? No, yeah. I think other cruise lines do it as oh, well. Okay. Um, but you find a group, you find the fish extender group, and then um, someone, um, what do they call a mod, right? Yeah. <laughs> um, puts everything together and assigns people in groups. Um, shout out to Keith. He was our mod for our, our Yo, uh, thank you, Keith. Group. Thank you so much, Keith. Um, so anywho, we um, you get assigned a select number of groups. We have, t we have nine other families in our group of 10 that we're going to be exchanging with this um, this trip and then you make what high techie we make we make a fish extender um, which is kind of like a mailbox uh, really so you hang it outside of your door uh, uh, you know extend it from the little fish here um, and then you you have little slots for everyone um, so you decorate it all. yeah so I you can decorate it um, and make it look nice and fancy and then I have a different slot for everyone including Trey Cher who is mm -hmm. celebrating his birthday oh, uh, yes so he's um, fresh off the ice cream fresh off the ice cream um, so we have our fish extender here we have our gifts that we're going to be handing out throughout the trip as well um, so we'll get to that um, but another thing that we do on the Disney cruises is uh, people really get into decorating um, when decorating we got here the yeah decorating the doors when we got here we had these really cool magnets because we're Div Disney Vacation Club members so they gave us complimentary complimentary magnets um, but we also I also got some other um, decorations and magnets to put on the door so um, before we we go to bed because we are pooped we want to kind of fancy up and dress up our door um, so we can truly be in the spirit of the Disney cruise and then and we're Halloween going to on the and, high seas. yes and Halloween on the high seas um, and also Techie's birthday they got some fish extending <laughs> just down there <laughs> look at the joy <laughs> I love it <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and finish decorating and then we're going to call it a night because we have a full day at sea tomorrow <laughs> We'll check back in once it's all decorated. birthday boy we have happy birthday with our pumpkin jack going along with our little theme here and we have our decorated state room door. we have our fish extender and it is time to go to bed because we are going to lose an hour going down to Mexico so please make sure to like and subscribe and leave us a comment down below if you have been on a Disney cruise because maybe you know some things that we don't you can teach us lots lots right and make sure to check out the other episodes that we put out as far as our adventure here on the high seas goes until then we love you God loves you go out there and spread some love <laughs> bye